what's going on everybody welcome back to another video today I am going to be reviewing the spoolin dog bone insert for the mark 7 GTI so I purchased this about a year and a half ago and it's been sitting in my toolbox ever since now you're probably wondering why will you buy the insert for the car and just keep it in the box and the answer for that's very simple I personally did not like this and let me tell you why when I first installed this on the car I went to start it for the first time and the whole thing was just vibrating and shivering like if it was negative five degrees outside. I'm so cold that I'm shivering. So I knew about the vibration that comes with this insert here, but honestly I didn't think it was going to be that bad. So I put the car in first gear to take it for a quick drive and the engine stalls on me. I know it sounds kind of funny, but it happened. For some reason, it felt like the engine was missing power, like if it was struggling to even stay running at idle. And definitely, I felt like it had to be revved up higher just to get it going in first gear. So I finally get it up to speed. And once I was doing like about 10, 15 miles an hour, the car felt normal. So it seemed like the vibration was only at idle and pretty much just uh, first gear so I did what everybody does as soon as they're done installing new parts on their cars and that's downshift and step on it and see if this part right here was actually going to make any difference and let me tell you guys the acceleration I got from this car was just crazy I didn't believe something so simple can make the car accelerate like that so I drove the car for the rest of the day and the next morning I took the insert back off. Uh, now you're probably wondering, so is this a good modification for my car or is not? And honestly guys, I think it all comes down to your own preferences. If you're thinking of putting crazy power into your car, then definitely something like this is a must for you. Um, if you don't mind about the vibrations and stuff like that, you definitely want to have this because this will help you out with traction and also smoother shifting. On the other hand, if you're like me and you're concerned about vibrations, weird sounds and stuff like that on your car, I will suggest maybe looking into a different set of tires uh, to get better traction or something different. Um, there's also different options of inserts out there maybe look into a different one they are all made out of different materials and I'm pretty sure they're gonna make a difference in the way the car feels so maybe just do your research uh, find something that it's not as aggressive as this one unfortunately I made the mistake of buying the extreme version from the two that Spoolin makes and they do make a street version which I'm pretty sure this, the material is way softer and the vibrations are less so just make sure you do your research before you purchase one that way you're happy with your purchase and you don't have to keep this in the box like I did if you guys have any questions or anything that I didn't mention in the video uh, feel free to leave me a comment right down below and I'll be more than happy to answer any questions you guys might have and also don't forget to like and subscribe I have more videos coming hopefully you guys are enjoying them so yeah, that was it for today's review. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one.